guys, it's Teresa here of Larkin Design, and welcome to my Traveler's Notebook. This is one that I'm hoping to work on throughout the summer, and I'm using the Gossamer Blue Traveler's Notebook Kit. This was the first one that came out in the month of May, and so what I'm going to do with it is just document a few of my favorite things that I come across throughout the summer this year, and um, so I'm starting out just with the first layout. I'm going to leave the cover blank. Um, I think that I'm just going to leave my Traveler's Notebook covers blank since they go with me and they go in my purse and they get a lot of wear. So I think I'm going to just leave the covers blank on them. Um, but what I thought I would start with is a crochet project that I finished up recently. And so it's one that I had worked on probably, probably for a year and a half or two years. I don't know. I tend to start a crochet project and it takes me a few years to finish it. <laughs> um, but a couple of weeks ago, I just, one weekend, just picked it up and was like, you know what? I'm just going to finish this thing. And I spent the whole weekend doing the border for it and finishing it all up. <clears throat> So I'm also using the Gossamer Blue Life Pages kit from May as well. Um, of course, coordinated products that work really well together and um, give you a lot of choices here. So I did put a strip of washi tape down the center. That's a crepe paper washi tape. Um, and that's just... I like to do that in my traveler's notebooks because the gutter where the pages meet on the center that's just a thick gutter and this is a thick um, traveler's notebook I'll probably end up actually um, doubling some of these pages up because there are a lot of pages in it which is good you want a lot of pages in your traveler's notebook but they are thinner they're not like cardstock weight or anything like that so I'll probably end up just doubling these up. Um, I am adding a piece of the pattern paper here on the left-hand side. So these pattern papers are designed by France Wisniewski of Banana Fish Studio. Amazingly talented artist and such an inspiration. If you're looking for Traveler's Notebook inspiration, she is the first person that I will recommend you look up. Um, she's on Pinterest, she has a blog, and of course, she's on the Gossamer Blue blog often as well. Just very talented artist. I love her work and love her as a person too. So, um, just so thrilled that she has this kit and that she's um, designing this for them. It's just a lot of fun. I really, really, really am loving these epoxy paper clips. They're giant and they're epoxy and they have a, an adhesive back and they're just awesome and the stamp set is the life pages stamp set and i'm going to tell you that i ordered the life pages kit just for this stamp set i love it it's so cute and um, just really fun to use lots of cool phrases and great little artwork on it I really like this circle here and so I'm putting it in several places across the page here and so you can see I have a, a black and white sort of theme going here and then a splash of color and you'll probably see me doing this a lot in the next few weeks I don't know I'm just really liking black and white and then a little splash of color it's um, it's making me happy right now, so I'm going with it. I'm going to just date this because um, I wanted to document the date that I finished the the scarf. I, I don't think it's really a scarf, uh, and it's not really a shrug. It's really just a rectangle with a big, giant ruffle around it, and, it, and, it, and I just fold it in half and wrap it around my neck, and then... Um, it has a little button that buttons to keep it on 
it's really cute and it's really warm of course it's summer and so <laughs> I won't be wearing it until fall but who cares it's a project that I finished so there you go celebrate the projects that you finished I think that that's a, always a good idea and these travelers notebooks are a great place to document things like that um, I have some other crochet projects that I've been working on photographing lately and so I'm probably well I am working on a, a compiling those together and making a traveler's notebook for my crochet projects um, it's something that I've been working on I just don't have any to share yet but this is for now what I'm doing for now here we go here's my date I added just a few of the little floral embellishments I tucked them around the photo and around the label and maybe another stamp here and there there were some really cute um, hearts and stars in this stamp set it's really tiny ones they're so much fun I love tiny stamps this is definitely a very fun kit to work with and I have to say that I'm so happy I'm happy that Gossamer Blue has come back with their exclusives I love their exclusives and they're so much fun to work with so yay happy 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 I made it a slight mistake when I stamped that sentence up at the top I didn't really like how that looked so I just layered a word strip over top of it and then I think that about wraps it up so thanks for watching today I hope you will like and comment and subscribe I'll see you back here again soon and um, thanks again you guys bye bye <laughs>